In today's episode, we're digging. Okay, today's an episode is more digging. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Let's Play with Wang. I'm your host, Slick Wang. We hotter than hell, and I don't know why. Is it because? It's because that furnace is there. It's not even on. That's stupid. Anywho, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I have trees. I have trees. Lots and lots of trees. I'll show you guys. I've done I've done a fair amount of work off camera. Um, planted some oak trees. Boom, boom, boom. We planted our orange sapling. We also planted a jungle sapling. So I've got jungle trees up there. Um, planted our apple sapling. It's been great. We've been uh, combining the, the apples and oranges and making a fruit salad. No more cantaloupe for Mr. Wang. No, sir. Freaking cantaloupe. Disgusting. Um, <laughs> hooked up our, uh, our water system since we had to make this tank. Put it down. Um, this little guy. We are still... Yeah, I've done... I, I did a lot of leaf... Leaves? Gathering? I don't know. The item's called leaves but I would be gathering leaves. Hmm. Anyway, <laughs> not to get caught up on semantics. Um, let's get caught up on some antics. Oh, look at that. You see what I did there? Uh, love it. That's why you guys watch. That's that's the that's the quality entertainment you guys are come to enjoy. <laughs> um, one of the things that I decided uh, while I was off camera and poking around and doing all that kind of fun stuff is uh, this building right here is going to be like my smeltery industrial building. Um, this is where we are going to put our smeltery, we'll put our high oven, um, all of that wonderful stuff. Um, this building right here incredibly dangerous um, even with it completely closed up somehow those freaking pigmen still managed to escape I, I don't know how it's boggling my mind the only thing I can figure is this there's a spawner in there and the spawner range is somehow just outside of the building um, so anyway enough catching up here's what we're doing um, I cleaned out that second floor that we were just on. Um, didn't really bother to show you guys just because I'm interested in getting going. Um, I cleared that out. I think that's where I'm going to do my new Matacraft stuff. Um, so we'll, we'll, when we get into that, that's where we'll lay things out. And that's actually one of the next uh, quests that I have. And something fun I learned about these oak desks. They don't really want to break with the Matic. You can sit here and pound away for a long time, and they won't go away. But if I use my sword, they break relatively quickly. So, yeah, I don't know. Weird. Might have something to do with this whole, oh, now you're going to let me? Really? That's, that's how we're going to do it? Maybe it depends on the item? I don't know. It doesn't seem to want to let me uh, mine any of the, the dust without a tool in my hand. So, kind of weird. If we ever get to a spot where we're dug in but don't have any tools, we'd be screwed. Um, so let's head over here and let's start getting our stuff so that way we can lay out our smeltery. Um, we have... Uh, what we got? We got this whole chest is basically full of stuff. So let me clear some crap out of my inventory. And... Um, yeah, we'll get it all laid out. Alright, about have the stuff we're gonna need, I believe. Um, slap some glass in this, baby. I figure if we're gonna use it, we should probably just restore it to its original glory, which I don't have nearly enough glass for. Um, so, good news is we, we have a quick escape route. Um, let's grab... How did I leave that stool there? Get it? Stool? I got all kinds of jokes today. Oh, see? Here he comes. Here's your 
here's how we take care of that. Hey, buddy, buddy. Is he a giant? He must be a giant. Yeah, it seems to be mostly giants that are escaping. Um, okay. How are we doing here? Okay, let's put that there. Um, I'm gonna need that. I would much rather have that. Okay. We're safe? We're safe for now. Okay. Um, something else I'm going to make is going to be a chisel? Is that not the recipe? That's not the recipe, apparently. How do you make? How do you make a chisel? That always was the recipe. Oh, it's one! Oh. Cool. Alright, I'm, I'm down with that. Bam. All those guys <laughs> makes me so nervous. Oh man. Okay, we'll we'll hide up here for now. Um, so brought the chisel. That way we can uh, we can put some pieces back together and mess around with a little bit of that. Um, in fact, oh, I hate that they're in there and that they can escape. Let me go get. I'm gonna get some more glass. That's what I'm gonna do. We'll get some more glass so we can seal ourselves in. Yes. Give me the glass. Oh. Hurry up. Whew. Whew. Okay. <laughs> uh, I live dangerously. Uh, let's get our sleeping bag and go Mimi's. Let's go Mimi's. Alright, lovely. Now, let's see something here. Crack seared bricks, okay. What if I put those in? No, okay, so those are just basically going to be cracked forever. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. Unless I really don't want my smeltery to look cracked. Okay. Um, so front door there. Elevator here. I'm thinking smeltery goes here. That's what I'm thinking. Um, Alright. Uh, did I bring a tank? How did I not bring a tank? Shoot. Okay. Let me actually get everything we need to build the dang smeltery. Okay. You guys were probably like, Wang, you already have the tank. <laughs> uh, so flustered, man. I get, yeah, I get little, I get a little wacky when I'm nervous. Whew. So the the sound of all of these guys, oh my god, it just, I hate it so much. Um, in fact, let's go ahead and put that there. That'll protect us for a little bit. Oh my god, all this stuff flying in my inventory. Get out of here. Go. Thank you. Didn't I already put you in there? Alright, let's slap some bricks down. Bam. Okay. And now I'm thinking... Tank can go there. That's where we'll keep our lava. Um, and let's put stuff there and there. And... Um, let's just... Throw. I'll use a chest. Um, this this is gonna look much different in in a little while. Um, <laughs> let's throw that down there. Who this thing takes up a bunch of room. Okay, we're gonna push it. We're gonna push it out a little bit. Tank. We'll go there. Put a couple bricks here. Um, let's grab, sure, why not, we'll put you right there. Um, boom, 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 boom. 
Let's get this little fella. Actually, maybe I like the way that looks. Do I like how that looks? I think I like how that looks. Bam. Okay. Now we're going to need a little more brick action. Bam. Got to break these little guys. Okay. And... Let's do... Little bit more. One more. Voila. There we go. We have ourselves a smeltery. Now let's see. Whew. It gets hot in here real quick. You guys see my little thermometer thing over there? Oh, and that's because of the torch. Yeah, look look how freaking hot it gets over here. Boom, all the way up. So, we have ourselves a smeltery, which is fantastic. Nope, gonna move it down. <laughs> oh my god. I'm a slave to making things look the way that I want them to. It's, it's really a curse. <laughs> oh lordy. Now we'll put here. Really? Can I make it facing this way? I wonder if I could. I've never I've never actually tried that. Can we do it that way? We'll have to see if it pours in a little while. Um, okay. So we've got all of that. Cool. We'll go ahead. We'll put our casting table there. Put our casting basin there. Now the next step, we're going to need some lava. All right, so now we're making, we're going to be making a lava factory, fundamentally. Um, so we're going to throw our furnace down here. I made another one of these uh, crucibles. Um, so we need to get our crucible, and the more I think about it, I think we're just going to do this for now. I think it'll operate with just a torch. We'll see. <laughs> it's going to be kind of ridiculous if we can make a lava using a torch. Um, let's see here. Ooh, I might. Well, you know what? I think we'll be okay. Is it four? Yeah, it's four. Okay, perfect. That'll be just enough for a bucket of lava. Awesome. Okay. So we'll be able to put some lava underneath of it in theory. Um, and we can set up a uh, our same cobblestone generator. And we can just pump cobble into that, and then pump lava into this. And it will be infinite lava forever. Forever! So that'll be pretty sweet. Um, getting caught up. Um, hopefully you guys have been wondering, hey, what's going on with Mr. Wang? Where's he been? That I say hopefully, because that means you guys have missed me. Um, get a little food in us. Um, I have been so ridiculously busy lately um, this last week at work has been I'm not gonna say the most stressful but it has been by far the most frustrating week that I've had in probably the last probably two years um, it has just been a freaking nightmare um, for those of you guys who have not watched me for very long. Um, I am a manager at my place of employment. Um, and so kind of what that boils down to is um, I have to manage people. And I'm the kind of manager, I, I take my job very seriously. Um, I can be the very, very cool manager, um, or I can be the jerk manager. I, I can do both of those. Um, uh, there's a time and a place for both, I think. Um, and plain and simple, I don't like being the jerk manager. I really, I do it because I have to do it. Because, um, you know, sometimes being being the nice guy, being the buddy, it just doesn't really work. Um, and I think anybody in management could tell you that. Um, so this last week, it, it really seems like 
everything we've learned, every process we have in place, everything, pretty much everything, um, has just been so ridiculously screwed up um, and done wrong and done without any kind of care. Um, it, it just absolutely so frustrating. Um, and being that I take my job very seriously, um, you know, because, and when I, when I say I take it seriously, it doesn't mean that I'm always like, oh yeah, company, company, company. That, that's not me. You know, I, I am a, I am a company man, but I do it, um, so that I can provide for my family. That is why I go to work. That's why I get up in the morning and do what I do. Um, yeah, that's, I mean, plain and simple. Um, so it's very important to me that my work is done well and taken care of and all of those kinds of things. Um, so it gets very frustrating um, when we start doing it poorly um, because I look at, you know, holy cow, um, how am I going to feed my kids when, when we're not doing this and therefore not making any money and stuff like that. Um, so that's kind of been my week. It, it has been a nonstop struggle. And in fact, Monday morning, um, I'm having a meeting with all of my guys and I'm going to let them know about my frustrations. Um, <laughs> so who knows? They're, they're, they're not going to be too happy about that. Um, cause when I have to have those meetings, um, I, I want to make sure that my point has gotten across. So that's that's what's been going on. Um, getting up early um, to do this. All of a sudden, uh, my son has been getting up incredibly early. Um, and he just comes in and just says hi and everything. But um, that, that kind of kills my ability to record for you guys. Um, so just all kinds of stuff going on so I hope you guys have missed me and I'm sorry if you have but I still hope you missed me <laughs> um, but we're I'm hoping to get back into a good schedule um, I've got a couple things a couple things in the works to hopefully stay connected with you guys um, during these kinds of times where I am just slammed um, and I'm not able to record because the you know, fact of the matter is these times are going to happen again. Um, you know, we got we got the Christmas season coming up here, so going to be all kinds of busy with things like that. And um, yeah, I've got got a couple things. We've got uh, Slickwang.com is now active and operational. Uh, right now, everything on there is basically just a placeholder, um, but it's there. It's there, and I can do stuff with it, and I'm basically going to use it as a blog. Um, so, you know, I'll post things and, and do that kind of stuff. And um, I'm actually thinking some stuff that I'll do um, is every once in a while, I'm going to post a video that is unlisted. And what that means is you won't see it, um, you won't see it in my activity um, you won't uh, you won't get notifications of it. The only way you'd get it is if you have the link. And I'm going to start doing those kinds of things, and I'm going to put them on the website. So check the website. I'm not going to say too regularly. I'll start letting you guys know as those happen. Um, but start checking. Oh, I wasn't ready for that. I was ready for a creeper. Um, oh, heart attack, small heart attack, almost died, oh my god, not in the game, in, in real life, I almost died, Whew. Um, so I'll let you guys know when, when things start posting on the, on the website, and, um, so that way it won't just be like, you guys are constantly on there just hitting F5, waiting for stuff to happen, um, that won't, that won't be the way that I operate, um, so yeah, bear with me guys. I, I really appreciate all the support. So we have ourselves a smeltery. Um, let's take a look at our quest book right quick. Um, open this. We still need to do some plastic, which I have. 
I have a rubber tree. Um, so we can probably start getting on that. That printed circuit board looks crazy difficult. Um, and I think we actually need to do some of this in order to get there. Um, so we are going to make... We're going to make this stuff. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to put pneumaticraft stuff up here. Um, so smeltery down here, pneumaticraft down there. Rock and roll. Keep pouring. Give me a cast. Yes. Yes. Thank you. So my my big long-term lofty goals, I want to dig this entire city out. Yeah, you heard it here first. I'm going to dig the entire city out. I mean, if we're going to reclaim a city, we we got to restore it. we got to restore it to some of its former glory, right? Right? You guys with me? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. I'm not going to be like, okay, in today's episode, we're digging. Okay, today's an episode is more digging. That That's, that's not going to happen. I'll do a lot of it off camera. Uh, let's see. I, I tell you, I'm trying to be an off and not recording because I've been so busy lately. Um, it feels weird. It feels very weird pressure so we need a pressure chamber wall pressure chamber window and a pressure chamber valve um, yeah, we don't have enough okay took a bit of pounding and stuff but we got ourselves pressure chamber glass pressure chamber window um, let's see broke our freaking hammer which sucks. Um, you guys stack. Why aren't you? There we go. Okay. Um, so, pneumaticraft. Pneumaticraft. I believe it's going to be a 3x3x3. Three by three by three. Let's see. Yep, 3x3x3 three 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 cube. So I still got to get that freaking valve, um, which means I'm going to need more sand which means I need another hammer. <laughs> oh my god, I can't wait till we get into some automation and, and we don't have to do this just slow, grindy stuff. Oh lordy. Got ourselves a little TNT. Um, we grabbed our stack of iron. We need to turn magnet mode off. Um, let's see. In fact, let's just let's do it inside of this little hill here. Why not? Bam, 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 bam. Cool. Okay, so let's take... Um, yeah, I'm going to do a full stack. Okay. And put our TNT there. And our pressure plate there. Light it. Oh no, I'm stuck. Boom. Okay, cool. Magnet mode on. Okay, cool. Got some more compressed iron. Beautiful. All right. Let's go see if we can finish this quest. Possibly fire up. Possibly fire up this thing. Okay, put that there. And then we need a pressure chamber valve. And no. Don't feel like fighting right now, pig. Okay. Luckily, he wasn't much of a fight. Good. Okay. Uh, this. Oh, come on. Okay. Simply break the middle of the blocks, toss in whatever you want, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So here's what we got to do. Um, pressure chamber wall. Where do I want to put you? Um, I'm going to put you here. I hope I'm doing this right. Do these... Oh man, this takes forever to break. 
Oh, lordy. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, so walls up. Um, so much crap in our inventory. Okay. Window. Because why not? Window. Window. <clears throat> and window. Okay. Now, let's go ahead. Let's put some dust so we can get up here. Alright, now, pressure chamber valve, because this is where air pressure has to go in. Now we should... Ha-ha! Lovely! You know it works once you have that, uh, once you have that lovely GUI pop-up. And just because I'm like OCD, and I really wish that these would face all out the right way, Let's change how they face. All right, so what we want to do, <clears throat> we're going to run our tube this way. A lot of guys put it in the side, but I don't know. I just, yeah, you know me. You know me. I'm going to do what I'm going to do. Um, so let's see. Let's actually, can I break you with a pick? I can break you with a pick. Lovely. Um, what happens if I do, do you connect that way? I think you'll connect that way. Okay, so now what we can do, please don't be any bad guys. Let's grab one, one piece of charcoal. We'll put one piece of charcoal in here. So that thing fires up. Nope. Okay. So I'm going to need to make more tubes. <laughs> oh, lordy. You can hear it. You can hear the air hissing out. It's pretty sweet. So this pressure gauge tube, it lets us see what the pressure is. Oh, that's lovely. That is super lovely. Boom. Boom. Okay. Now we should be good to go. You still work? You still work. Okay. Let's put one charcoal in here. Um, get rid of that. Oh, my lord. Okay. Now, let's see if we can bang something out really fast. Okay. So, making it work. We have the compressed iron. Eh, kind of cheaty. Um, so, we want the green plastic. Green plastic. Plastic. Green. So creeper plant seeds. Alright, we'll head back. We'll head back over here. Get ourselves some creeper plant seeds. Because I know I have tons. This little guy, you see these particles coming off. It'll actually emit a redstone signal. And a big part of the reason for that, and I, I think the quest line and everything covers this, but basically, you can get this thing, once you get that pressure gauge all the way up into the red, this thing could explode, which we might do at some point, just just do. Okay, so, um, to make the green plastic, this little guy has to come up to about a half, okay? Huh, I wonder why there's two. Okay, um, so let's get our pick. Now, when we open this thing up, we're going to lose pretty much all of our air pressure. Um, okay, got to turn magnet mode off, because what we do, we throw that in there, and get our window back. Boom. Okay, so this guy's at basically zero. So let's put two pieces in. 0.5 bar. So that should be right about where that thing starts making it happen. Yeah! We just made plastic. How cool is that? Break this thing open. And turn on our magnet mode. Put that there. There's wasting fuel left and right. Okay. 
Uh, please be the last thing in the quest. It is. Okay, so I'm not going to bother making plastic, but these squid plant seeds. I think I'm going to make those. Do, 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 do. Not, uh, you know, kind of a catch up, and I feel like I was kind of funky today, but hopefully you guys understand I'm, I'm, I honestly feel like I'm in a weird fog, like I've forgotten how to do this by, by not doing it for one day. Um, but, you know what? We got our pressure chamber built. Um, we got our smeltery built. So we are about to embark on getting some serious, some serious work done. So, as always, guys, thank you very, very much for watching. I really appreciate the support. I really appreciate you guys sticking around, even though it seems like the last week or so my my recording schedule has been spotty. Um, but I, I really appreciate you guys. Um, really appreciate you guys sticking it out for me. Um, so thank you guys very, very much. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Do that stuff down at the bottom. It really helps me out. And stay tuned. We're gonna have uh, we're gonna have some more stuff, some more stuff, and some things. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you in the next episode.